Hello, welcome to the Paul Pluto channel, the premium choice for paid watch reviews and opinions. And today I'm doing another paid review because I don't do shit for free. Remember, like, subscribe, tell your fuckhead friends and look in the description for 10 ways, 10 ways you can keep me full time on YouTube, full time on YouTube. Today, this is from Charlie. Hi Arch, hope hope all is well. I just sent you $20 for a watch review and advice. I currently have three watches and am looking to add a fourth. I have two dress watches which I wear for work. An Amiga DeVille Prestige on black strap and an Oris Artilia Complication on brown strap. I know these are not the most interesting, but I wear a suit five days of the week and need a couple of professional looking pieces. I then have a Tudor Black Bay Blue. I want a fourth watch. I have thin wrists and would prefer something at 40mm or under. I'm considering the IWC Pilots Mark 18 or a second hand Rolex Explorer. Maybe an Amiga Aquaterra. Budget is around 4,000 US. What would your take be on the Explorer one on a rubber or NATO? I'm not a huge fan of steel straps. What are your thoughts on my watches and what should I buy? Okay, let's discuss this. So, the Amiga DeVille Prestige. What the fuck were you thinking? How? Fucking stupid can you do to go and buy one of those? The Oris? Fuck me dead. Oris is a shitter of a brand. I mean, it's garbage. It's absolute crap, Charlie. I don't know what the fuck you were smoking, but fuck me dead. Charlie, 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 Charlie. You want to see my advice? I mean, what do I say to you? Oh, yeah, that's a great watch. What do I fucking say to you? Do, do I... Do I fucking pretend you got reasonable stuff? Or do I fucking tell you the truth? Blow it out of the fucking water. That's what I'm thinking. Blow this bitch out of the fucking water. Because, Charlie, what the fuck were you thinking? I don't understand this shit. I mean, fuck me dead. Fuck me dead, Charlie. All I can say is, what the fuck were you thinking when you bought these fucking pieces of shit the amiga is boring fucking dress watch they don't make dress watches they make sports divers or chronographs i love my amiga the deville prestige is a fucking piece of shit fucking shitter charlie it's fucking shitter come on man you should know better than that it's a Fucking shitter! It's a fucking shitter, Charlie. As for your Oris, fuck me dead, man. What the fuck? Have you fucking watched any of my fucking videos in your fucking fucking fucked life? Fuck me dead. I don't understand this shit. I don't fucking understand why the fucking hell you would buy absolute fucking shitters. Fucking shitters. That's what they are. The Tudor Black Bay Blue, yeah, it's possible. It's about the best out of this garbage fucking collection you've got, Charlie. That is about the best out of this fucking garbage fucking shitter fucking collection you've got, man. You need to fucking get rid of the Omega. Get rid of the Oris. Tudor, we can hold. Man, get the Explorer one. Man, I'm not going to argue with someone who thinks a fucking... Omega DeVille Prestige is a cool fucking watch. Man, you gotta have fucking rocks in your fucking head. Grab the Explorer 1. Grab it. Grab it with both fucking hands. Get it. Just get that fucking thing. Forget the IWC. That's for people who think Oris, Artilias, and Omega DeVille Prestige are cool. Don't buy that shit. Buy a fucking Rolex. 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 Buy a fucking Rolex, man. Charlie, 
Work with me, not against me. Those things are fucking shitters. They're fucking shitters, man. Fuck me, Dad. What the fuck were you thinking when you fucking bought that fucking piece of fucking shit? What the fuck? What the fuck? Amiga DeVille Prestige, that is an ugly, ugly, ugly fucking piece of shit. The uh, Oris Artelia Complication, man. What the fuck were you thinking? Why the fuck did you buy that shit? Why the fuck did you buy that shit? I don't understand this. Man, they are fucking ugly. The tuner is semi-passable. Tudors for people who can't afford a Rolex. They buy Tudor. They buy Tudor. Get the Explorer 1. Get the fucking exec second-hand Explorer 1. Get that. Add a bit of style. Add a bit of class. And fucking be done with it, Charlie. I don't fucking know what to say, Charlie. What the fuck? What the fuck were you thinking when you bought that fucking piece of shit. Fuck me, Dad. Fuck me, Dad. I don't know what to think. Charlie, man, you've watched any of my videos? Come on, man. Get out of those shitters. That shitters. The Omega DeVille Prestige. Yeah, I like Omega. Yeah, I do. I like Omega. But I'm not going to fucking, fucking kowtow to corporate turds. Corporate turds. Man, that is a fucking fucking shitter of a watch. You have to have fucking rocks in your fucking head to buy that garbage. Buy the Explorer 1. The Pontiff has spoken. You either listen to me or fuck off. Archie Luxury over and out, fuckers. We specialize here in pre-owned Rolex watches. Rolex watch is a very special timepiece and we always do the servicing exactly as factory specifications. We buy a pre-owned piece and we put it into brand new condition. We have Rolex certified technicians working on that. We completely disassemble the piece, we adjust and polish and change every single part of the watch. You have to have certified watchmakers that know what they're doing. If you have an expensive car, you're just not going to bring it to any mechanic that doesn't know what they're doing. You spent $5,000, it's like if you put money in the safe deposit box. And one or two years from now, you will keep having your $5,000. We have to spend a lot of money to get all this equipment together, but makes me feel I'm doing what I'm supposed to do. It's not a question of money, it's my passion. Jewelers on time, simply the best.